My name is Marielle Buckley, and I'm an Americana singer-songwriter from Calgary, Alberta. I use the word Americana because it sits on the outskirts a little bit. It's based in traditions like bluegrass, folk, and western, but it isn't quite mainstream. I wasn't raised on the farm. I'm a city kid. I can't drive a tractor. I can't ride a horse. Terrified of horses, actually. My brother is an amazing singer-songwriter, and we've always uh, shared a pretty special bond. Growing up, I would steal his tragically hip CDs from his bedroom. I cut my hair like his. I wore his old clothes. It makes sense that I followed him into music. I had a really hard time growing up. Being different is one of those things that, when you're older, it becomes a bit of a blessing, but when you're too little to figure it all out, the world can be unkind. That underdog spirit is kind of what pushes me now. It drives me. Catching people in their most vulnerable while I'm at my most vulnerable is what I think great performance and songwriting is all about. And songwriting is cathartic. I use it to tell stories I've lived and seen. I use it to escape. I use it to relate to people and connect. Somebody told me the best artists mirror the world around them, and I think that's really what I try to do. Over the last five years, I've built my identity. I've crafted songs I'm really proud of. I've assembled a band and team who support my vision. And we work hard to improve and craft a memorable live show. Every year, it seems we tour more and more. After Driving in the Dark came out, we saw some local and international success. We've played almost every major folk festival in Western Canada. Growth is really important to me. Patience, too. I didn't come into this expecting to win as much as I came in expecting to work and to learn. Industry training and all that knowledge that I can grab onto is very valuable because that's what's going to help me have a career with longevity, which is what I'm looking for. This is what I'm supposed to be doing, and it's, this is my life's work. We're not going to stop working. I guess in a lot of ways I feel like I'm just getting started.